This channel, which uploaded only 90 videos, already hit almost 600,000 subscribers, and the creator behind this is making thousands of dollars per month. Yes, guys, these videos are literally nothing but simple, relaxing, sleeping videos. Actually, people are loving this kind of videos, and you can see it in their comments. While most creators fight to hold attention for 30 seconds, this channel keeps people watching and sleeping for two hours straight. But here's the best part. You don't need a voice like David Attenborough. You don't need a fancy mic or editing rig, and you don't need to be an expert in history or storytelling. All you need is just two AI tools. One is ChatGPT and the other one is CapCut. In this video, I'm going to give you a set of well-crafted prompts to generate scene-by-scene -scene scripts, a method to create these types of videos without using any external text-to-video software, a way to unlock all premium features in CapCut without using any mods or illegal methods. But keep in mind, you should take advantage of this trick before the CapCut team finds out and patches it. Finally, I'll show you how to create SEO-optimized titles and eye-catching thumbnails within minutes. So make sure to watch this video until the end, and please support us by liking and subscribing to the channel. Now, let's get started. The niche I'm talking about is called Boring History for Sleep. I've added a sample example result at the end of this video, because I don't want you to fall asleep just yet. And yes, this is a completely free tutorial. Step 1. Just click the Google Doc link I've added in the description and copy the first prompt from it. Then, open chat GPT and paste the prompt. As you can see, the prompt is designed to create a two-hour format. You can change that if you want. I'm changing it here because this is just a tutorial to show you how it works. Then, click Generate. Now, ChatGPT will send you 10 different, unique, scroll-stopping video ideas. Go through all of them and choose one. Next, head back to the doc and copy the second prompt. Make sure to grab the entire thing. Paste it into ChatGPT, then replace the placeholder with your chosen video idea and click Generate. This prompt is designed to generate the full script, scene by scene, so you never hit a word limit. Once scene one is done, ChatGPT will ask you to type, continue. Do it to get scene two, then three, and so on, until your full video script is complete. Finally, you've got a professionally structured script for your video. I created this entire set of ready-to-use prompts just for you guys, so please like and subscribe to support our channel. Now let's turn each of these scripts into a video using only one tool, which is CapCut. So, open CapCut on your PC or laptop, then go to the AI Video Maker section and select Instant AI Video. Now, a panel will appear on the right. This is where the magic happens. Go back to ChatGPT and copy your Scene 1 script, then paste it into this text box. To customize your video inside CapCut, start by setting the aspect ratio to 16 to 9, which is ideal for YouTube. Then, choose a voiceover that suits your theme. For historical storytelling, a calm and deep voice works best. I personally prefer this one. When it comes to visual style, CapCut offers several themed options like neoclassic, prehistoric, or Roman art. For this tutorial, I'm selecting the prehistoric style. Once everything is in place, simply click Create and let CapCut do the heavy lifting. The rendering process usually takes around 10 to 15 minutes. After the video is generated, review it carefully. If there's an image that doesn't fit, just put the mouse on it, then tap Replace and select a visual style and aspect ratio, then click Generate. CapCut will give you four alternative styles to choose from. Choose one and click Add to Scene. Next, head over to the left-hand panel, find the Elements section, and under AI Edit, you will see this icon. Click on it and uncheck all options except sound effects. Then click Apply. Since this content is designed to help viewers sleep, you'll also want to disable captions. Once everything looks good and feels seamless, click the Export button to save your video. With your first scene complete and exported, repeat the same process for each remaining scene. Before we move on to the next part, I have something for you. If you're a fan of Google's VEO3 video generation tool, it's time to reconsider. I've added a video link in the description that talks about a new video model that outperforms VEO3 in most tests. Watch that video from the description and let me know your thoughts in the comments. Now back to our video. At this point, you have all your scenes ready, so let's combine them into one final video. Open CapCut's editing window and import all the scenes we generated earlier. Then, add them to the timeline in the correct order. Scene 1, Scene 2, and so on. Now, add transitions between the scenes. Don't worry, 
You can use any transitions, including pro ones, because I'll show you how to export the final video for free. After that, add video effects to make the video more engaging. I recommend searching for the fire effect and applying it across the entire video. Then go to the audio tab, click on sound effects, and search for fire. Drag the fire sound effect onto the timeline and make sure it covers the entire video. Once everything is done, click export, but you might notice CapCut doesn't allow you to export it at this point. Don't worry, here's the trick. First, go back to the CapCut home screen and click on settings. Under the drafts section, choose a folder where your drafts will be saved. I recommend creating a new folder to keep things organized. Next, return to your editing window. Select all the clips and elements in the timeline, then right-click and choose Create Compound Clip. After that, right-click on the compound clip again and select Pre-Process Compound Clip. CapCut will begin processing your full video. Once that's complete, open your file manager and go to the draft folder you selected earlier. Inside, find your project folder, open it, then navigate to the Resources folder, and from there, open the Combination folder. Inside, you'll find your fully rendered video. Welcome to another quiet journey through the past. Tonight, you're invited to drift through corridors that once echoed with hushed footsteps and whispered instructions. Clean, polished, and complete with all pro features. No watermark, no subscription needed, and 100% legitimate. Now you're ready to upload your full-length video to YouTube. You've created a piece of content that's designed not only to perform well, but also to help viewers relax, unwind, and fall asleep. Now we need titles and thumbnails. For the title, you don't need to do anything extra. When generating your scenes, ChatGPT already included it. But for the thumbnail, copy the third prompt from the Google Doc and paste it into any text-to-image generation tool. Then replace the placeholder with your selected video idea, then click Generate. Just like that, you've got your thumbnail. If you want to enhance it further, you can easily edit it using Canva. If this helped you, drop a comment saying sleep strategy and don't forget to like and subscribe for more no-fluff content tips.